All right, so we're out here uh, getting our methanol. As you can see, um, we like to keep it in a uh, location away from where the actual processor is at. Um, this is 100% methyl alcohol, uh, which is a racing fuel. We purchased it from a place that uh, uh, sells racing fuel. Uh, so like we said previously, we're going to go ahead and get about five gallons of this and take inside so we can continue the process. Oh, and uh, over here, it's nice to have some place. This is all uh, extra uh, vegetable oil storage for future biodiesel production. Um, it's just kind of nice to have it tucked away in a secure, locked location. All right, we're back inside with our methanol. Uh, I have here a five gallon container. We're gonna go ahead and fill that up with methanol. Okay, and now, like we said previously, after our titration, we're going to want to add 567.8 grams of lye. Uh, this container right here has 454 grams in it, so I'm just going to go ahead and add this whole thing. And then we'll measure out the remainder over on the bench. Give me a shot of that container. Hold it. All right, guys, we're back. Uh, we just got done adding 454 grams of uh, lye into our methanol. Uh, we're going to add the remainder here. Uh, what I have is just a little scale set for grams, and uh, the number we need is 567.8. So I'm going to do my math here. Uh, minus, we added 454 already. So I need to add 113.8 more grams. Okay, and here we made it down to 114 grams I got here. Um, that's close enough. Plus or minus five is kind of a rule of thumb for it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and add this into our. I'm going to go ahead and add this into our uh, sodium methoxide mix we have going. Then we're going to uh, take this down, stir it up, make sure we mix it up really well, um, and then we'll show you what's next in the process. 